What's popping again? Today we're going to be talking about five of some of the best plugins you can use for hooks, choruses, when you're mixing rap vocals. If you want more content like this, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, hit that like button. Also, hit that notification bell so YouTube promotes more videos like this to you. All right, gang. So let's go ahead and just show you some of the plugins that I really highly recommend. And some of these plugins on this list are actually free. So number one, let's go ahead and start off with Air Enhancer. So I really like this plugin for certain things. I don't use it all the time. You know, if you want to get that phone effect, sometimes what people do is they go to the EQ and they EQ the hell out of it and they get this phone effect that sounds like this. I'm on my shit. Okay, so that sounds good. It does sound like somewhat of a phone effect and all that, but you can use that and use this air enhancer effect, which actually makes it sound more like an actual phone. So here is the effect right here, and this is what it looks like. And it's pretty simple, super simple. Let me just show you exactly how to adjust this to get more of like a phone effect. I'm on my shit. So what I highly recommend doing is turn up the depth button right here. So turn this up, you, you'll get more of that effect, but to kind of like play around with some of these settings to see like what actually actually sounds better with your vocals. I'm on my shit. 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 So now you can hear it just adds some of that distortion and you know detail to the the phone effect which makes it sound more like an actual phone versus just using the EQ. And this plugin is free. It comes with Pro Tools. If you decide to get like the uh you know the lowest option, I think it's like 999 or something like that. Don't get mad at me if I'm wrong about this. You know, this. I think this does come with it. I don't know. I got the studio version. I highly recommend checking out this plugin. Well worth it. Next is a plugin called Wider. Now this is a really great plugin and it's free. So you guys can try it out. You know, regardless what DAW you're using right now, this is a free plugin and you know, I think I heard this type of effect on future song called Misogyny. You know what I'm saying? In the hook, you, you could tell like, it sounds like it's wide left and right, but it doesn't sound like it's two vocals. Okay, so I have my aux channel for the hook, which is pretty much like right here, literally right on the right here. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and put this effect on here. And on the new Pro Tools, I really like this. You can search for effects and stuff like that. So let's just type in wider. There you go, hit enter, boom. So let's go ahead and hear the hook with this effect on it. I carry a Glock, how to trip your top. Call him a partner, you dead. You broken, you done with the smoke. The working money get sweaty. I cut on the block, you niggas get popped. All of my niggas, they ready. Cocaine on the boat, cook up the coke. New whip, I dry like a sand machine. You deem it straight from the pit. So you can see it actually makes it sound wider. It's a free plug-in. This sounds great. I, I think it sounds great. You know, I don't I personally wouldn't use this on this particular song, but you know, if you decide, hey, I want to have some type of wide effect, you can use this wider plug-in and get great sounding vocals. And did I mention it was free? I don't think I mentioned that. So this next plug-in, you kind of gotta experiment with this because this is like going overboard. You don't normally do stuff like this. You know, if you decide to get really creative, you know, this plugin would definitely help help you get creative. And before I mention this, go ahead and hit the like button again because it helps out with the channel. All right, so for this next plugin, it's called Reverse Initial. Now this plugin, I, I honestly use like on a lot of my beats and stuff like that. But have you ever thought about using this on vocals? You know what I'm saying? Basically what this is, is like a reverse type plugin to like make things sound like it's reverse, but it's on beat. So what I'm thinking about is like actually using this in a different way, like actually using this on the delay. You know what I'm saying? I think that'll be a trippy effect. So I had this on an aux channel with reverse effect on it. So boom, I had that on there and I have this bus onto my hook tracks. So every vocal coming into the hook aux will have this delay reverse effect on it. So what I'm gonna do is to like make you hear this a little bit more. I'm gonna actually do an effect on the beat, make the beat sound like it's underwater and stuff like that. And then you can add this effect on it to get a, like a really trippy effect. You know, you could probably do this on stuff like when you have like a moment in the song, when you're on the like the last hook or something like that. I think that'll be pretty dope. So let's go ahead and Command E to cut this section out right here for the beat. So I did Command E to cut out this part of the beat that I just highlighted. And let's go to the audio suite. So let's add an effect called Lo-Fi. Turn the sample rate down maybe even the bit size. And then just go ahead and apply that render and then look here. 
carry a Glock, how to trip your top. Call him up. Now the beat sound like it's underwater and stuff. So we want to use that to really throw up this next effect that I'm talking about, which is using the reverse delays. All right, so I have the aux channel right here for the reverse delay. And let's just turn it up real quick. Let's change up the effects right here. So I like using one and a half and turning up the fade. This right here is kind of like a gate. It'll make whatever the reverse effect that you put on here sound like a gate. And I like that because it makes it sound more on beat. This whole session is already on the right tempo and everything. So I got this fader up here and I got it on one eighth. So let's hear it real quick when I turn it up. Call my partner to them. You broke and you done with the smoke. Smoke. The work and my niggas sweat. I cut on the block, you niggas get popped. All of my niggas, they ready. Yeah. Cooking on the boat, cook up the coke. The whip, I dry like a sandwich. All right, so you just heard what it sound like now. So what I would probably do is kind of add an EQ on there. Probably take out a lot of that low end there. Add some of the high end, maybe boost some around here. Just so you can hear it just a little bit more clearly. But let's go ahead and hear it again. I carry a Glock, how to trip your top. Call my partner to them. You broke and you done with the smoke. The work and money get sweaty. I cut on the block, you niggas get popped. All of my niggas, they ready. Cooking on the boat. You see that different effect that you don't normally hear a lot of people even experiment with, but you can try that out. So test it out. There you go. Next is the plugin called Slow Mo. Again, I use that plugin for making beats, but why not just try it out on vocals? Okay, so you have the slow mo effect here, and I put it on the exact same spot where I put the lo fi reverse effect in as last time so it's on the aux channel right here and i have the delay on there and i have the eq there as well so you can hear it just a little bit more clearly so let's go ahead and just try this out see how this sounds i carry a glock how to trip your top call my partner to them you broke and you done with the smoke so there you go guys that's that's another effect that you guys can add onto your music it's different you know what i'm saying it's not like a Oh, this you gotta have this right now, you know what I'm saying? But it's, it's different. You'll probably use this in like a you know bare minimum case scenarios, you know. But hey, you know now you have an idea that you could play around with. You're welcome. All right, gang. So I have one more effect that I want to show you. But real quick, hit that like button because it helps out with the channel. I appreciate you guys watching the videos. But let me show you this: the next effect, API 560. Now think about this, right? If your vocal is so dark and you just want to add some excitement to it, but you don't have an exciter plugin, maybe check out this one right here because this is not really an exciter plugin, but you can kind of use it in an exciter plugin type way. All right, so this is what I would do. So I would turn all these down here and then maybe just keep um, some some of these up, like uh, the higher frequencies. And you can just kind of play around with it just to you know, get the best results for you. And uh, you know, have it on the aux channel and make sure whatever aux your vocal that you want to affect on, like for, for me, I want to affect the hook. So I got the input on this channel, the hook. Let me go ahead and have that there and let's go ahead and try out this plugin. I cut on the block, you niggas get popped. All of my niggas, they ready. Cocaine on the boat, cook up the coke. New whip, I drive like a Sammy. New demon is straight from the pit. I'm on my shit, money making them petty. Fuck on the Becky, but call it like Pesci. The money be turning the mess. So as you can see there, you know, you can play around with this and really get high quality, crispy vocals, detailed vocals as well. Just by just using this effect right here and adding it as an aux channel instead of just placing it on the main channel. That definitely helps out with getting high quality vocals. If this video helped you so far, go ahead and hit the like button. Also subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And if you want to download any of my music templates and stuff like that, there will be a link in the description where I use the exact same template here in the description where you can download that and get high quality vocals in a short amount of time. You guys stay safe and remember, it's only a matter of time. Peace.